Hello, hello, I am CobKit, and welcome back. Um, we released a video recently, a uh, crafting tutorial to make our Creeper Boat banner, and of course, in less than a week, a new Minecraft update released, and they completely changed the banner crafting system. So we thought it would be nice to release an update on how to craft banners with the loom. Okay, so what are we going to do today? I thought it would be nice to make the white variant of the Creeper Boat banner. Uh, yeah, let's see, how do we do this? So, uh, you can use the regular crafting table um, to craft banners. It still totally works, you can follow the exact same directions, but you're not going to want to. The loom makes it far easier and cheaper to do so. Um, so let's see, how do you get a loom? A loom is crafted from two wood planks and two pieces of string. That will get you your loom okay so your ingredients that you're going to need are basically the same um but we're going to use these patterns now so what you want to do we'll need three patterns the pattern for the wither skull the pattern for the creeper head and the pattern for the vine um let's see skull charge creeper charge and the bordure indented uh to make those you mix let's see you don't even need to use the crafting table for this you can just do this in your inventory crafting grid. Um, take the skull and a piece of paper, and that'll get you your pattern. Just like that. Go ahead and do that here. Make all three, because we will need all three. Okay. Like that. And make our three patterns. Okay. So the steps are more or less the same. Let's just grab our materials. Like I said, we're gonna make the white variant banner today. Grab our lime dye, our brown dye. We already have our three patterns. So the loom is super easy to use. Okay, let me show you what to do. So we're gonna follow the same steps that we did last time. So click your banner in place. Choose your dye. In this case, it's gonna be green dye, right? And the first thing we're gonna do is put our skull pattern on gives you a preview of what you're going to make here and click it it gets that nice noise take it out okay gonna need to change the pattern our next thing to add is our creeper body you can see this is all going to look familiar if you watch the previous video click it again there we go simple as that um, now we're going to do some of our blocking let's see so here we're going to use white dye Okay, we don't need a pattern for this one. You can see all the different patterns that you're gonna have here. Oh, interesting, look, once you add the pattern, now it shows up on the loom, that's cool. You add it once and it looks like it's there forever. Neat. Um, click that, cover up one line, cover up this one, cover up the next line, give this our creeper body. Let's see. Add, switch out our dye for brown dye. Curve the bottom bit like that. Okay. Okay. And then it looks like I forgot to grab cyan dye. Here we go. Wait, do we want to do cyan? You know what? Let's not do cyan. Let's use light blue instead. This is going to be banner making. The joy of banner making. Okay. Here. Pop this in. We've got our border indented, color it cyan, and that's it. All done. Okay. And now you have our white variant creeper boat banner. So the loom, really easy to use, much cheaper. You only need one piece of dye. Uh, once you have your patterns, it looks like they get loaded into your loom forever. Hmm, neat. I wonder what happens if that copies... Uh, but anyway, cool enough. So super easy, much easier than the crafting table recipe. And thanks so much. I am Cobkit, and I will talk to you soon. Bye.